Hello everyone and welcome to the second episode of Sometimes Skylock. I am joined today as always by Jazz Panda and hello. this special guest. Hello. Forgot his name. Yeah, we both forgot his name, so we're just gonna call him the donkey for now. So in this episode we are going to be going over a couple things that we did uh, off screen and then we're going to be starting on the mob spawner. So uh, first thing we did is we moved the farm. So now it's just this little bit. I moved the farm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you moved the farm. So this blue glass represents where our old farm was in the water and all that. We moved it here to where part of the tree farm used to be. Um, you did a lovely job. Thank you. I say I'm, I'm using the royal we basically and just referring to you. Mm-hmm. I do everything. Except Shh. this. Yes, I did this. This is the AFK room. And um, you just open this gate so you don't get killed, and you close it, and then you go around in a circle, and then ignore the cat. I don't know how he got there. And Can't get him out. Yeah, we're just we're just gonna leave him because, frankly, he seems happy. And then uh, we, that's pretty much all we did, uh, aside from yeah. like bone mealing or like doing little touch-ups here and there. Um. You're probably going to see little differences in between episodes just because we do a lot of things off camera, but just ignore those inconsistencies, they're, they're, they're nothing major. Yeah. <laughs> we also started on the, um, spawner. Yeah, we started at the base of the spawner. So, these are our supplies. We have glass, cobble, some stone slabs, a bit of stone, uh, various wood items, and a lot of water. Because we're going to need water. <laughs> mm -hmm. You'll see why in a little bit. Um, so, do you want to explain the plan? Um, it's basically just gonna be a big box. Yeah. And there's little platforms on there with trapdoors on the side, and mobs will spawn there. And then they'll just walk off the edge because of the trapdoors. And then and they'll fall into water, yeah. which will push them into the hole, which will drop them 23 blocks, which will hurt them, and then they'll be down here. And then we can kill them! For their and then various there's drops. a hopper, collects all their stuff. Hello, we're back. We had a little bit of an interruption. We should probably be down in a recording suite. Um, this is what happens when you record on the our team speak. Hello, Panda. So yeah, now we have a little spectator named Aaron. Oh, what did he just say in team speak chat? <laughs> he said sorry. Oh, it's okay, Aaron. It's okay. We're not mad. You'll just be the mute spectator for this episode. Okay, so we're gonna get started on. Oh. Okay, ready? What? We're gonna get started on building the spawner. Okay. <laughs> and uh, we'll speed this bit up so you don't have to listen to us ranting about various things. And then we'll get back to you once it's finished. All right, so let's get started. Alright, so we've finished the spawner room as well as the tower. Let me get up here so you can see it. This is what the spawner looks like from the outside. Uh, it's. Where are you? I'm on the roof. Ah. Hello. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Um, I jump. It's not, not anything special. Don't expect anything amazing because I don't like building spawners. And this is what it looks like on the inside. I'm gonna die. This is what it looks like on the inside. There's just water streams coming off the platforms with trapdoors. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> I realized something. Yes. I realized a fatal error. What? Mobs consider trapdoors full blocks, right? Huh? The reason mobs will walk off trapdoors is because they think they're full blocks. And the only reason they'll walk off platforms is when the two trapdoors are touching each other because they think it's a bridge. What? So we need to put like blocks in the middle of all these. No, I don't. What? You can't that have worked before. You sure? Yeah, remember I was on the other one? <sighs> oh, okay. Just say so. Let's just try it. Yeah, give it a shot. If it doesn't work, we'll just put blocks in the middle or something like that. Yep. Hello, Doge. Dog. Bark, bark, hi, dear. Making that reference again, I should stop. Really should. Okay, this is what it looks like from the outside. It's okay, I need to fill up to see this. It's glorious looking, isn't it? 
box on oh. one leg. <laughs> so pro. I made I made that beautiful leg. Yes, you did. It looks amazing. And my, don't mind me like this guy. <gasps> the poor mushroom. And oh well, this rip. Ripperoni. Saw nothing. I saw what? Nothing. Exactly. All right. So uh, there's, a, there's a glass horse. Oh, hello, glass horse. Let me see if I can hit you back in. <laughs> you didn't go like it. Ah, did he move it all? <laughs> uh no. You idiot. Have some leather. I'm on the Have some leather horse. So yeah, that's it for this episode. <laughs> <laughs> we slaughtered some animals, showed off what we did off camera, and built a mob spawner that probably will work? <laughs> we'll see. We'll see, yeah. Anyway, let's uh, get in our chorus line. Alright, thank you guys for watching this episode of Sometimes Skyblock. In the next episode, we'll figure out something to do. We, um, again, this isn't exactly a normal series, it isn't scheduled. This is going to be a video series that we post whenever we don't have an official series to post. This is going to be um, probably every couple weeks uh, at the at the least. Yeah. Okay. Well, however that works. Anyway, any last words, Mr. Panda? Um, if you have any suggestions on what to make, feel free to tell us. Oh yeah, because we're unoriginal and have no idea what we're doing. We, we built all this and then we're like, now what? <laughs> yep. Alright, so see you guys in the next episode. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe as always, and we'll see you guys next time. Okay. Good job.